Let's look at reading a scatter plot. A scatter plot is a graph that's used to determine whether there is a relationship between paired data. It's similar to a line graph. If y tends to increase as x increases, then the paired data are said to have a positive correlation. x and y are both increasing or both decreasing, so they have a positive slope. If y tends to decrease as x increases, the paired data are said to have a negative correlation. One value increases as the other decreases, which gives it a negative slope. If there's no linear pattern, the paired data are said to have no correlation. Look at each of these graphs and see if you can determine whether they have positive, negative, or no correlation. Let's look at the first one. There is no correlation here because they do not have a positive or negative slope. There is no line. Looking at this next one, it's going in a positive direction, so that would be a positive correlation. And as you can see, as x increases, y is also increasing. On this one, we have x increasing, but y is decreasing, which causes it to have negative correlation. And for the last one, as x increases, y is also increasing, so that would be positive. So let's look at these situations. Traffic volume and time to drive home. The more traffic I have, the longer it's going to take me to drive home, and the less traffic I have, the shorter it's going to take me. So that's going to be a positive correlation because they are both increasing or decreasing. The average temperature outside and the amount of fuel used to heat a house. As the temperature rises, the amount of heat you use lowers. So that means it would be negative because one is increasing as the other decreases. And then I have height and the average of math test scores. This has no correlation because your scores are not affected by how tall or how short you are. So remember, just pay attention to if both are increasing or decreasing, which will give you positive, and if one is increasing while the other decreases, or the other way around, it will give you a negative correlation.